Hi, my name is Bree Clark, and today I'm going to show you how to use an if statement in Microsoft Excel to delete blank rows. You may have a document with some blank rows in it in Microsoft Excel, and there are several different approaches you could take to get rid of those blank rows, but right now I'm going to show you how to use an if statement to do it. First, I'll set up a column header. I'll call it test. Then in the first row of the data of my table, I'm going to start typing a formula. It's an if statement, equals if, and then I'll open the parentheses. And then I'm going to put a few logical tests in here, and my logical test is going to be if A2, B2, and C2 are all blank, then it will return a true or a false based on that statement. So I'll do an and and then I'll nest the is blank function for a2 comma is blank b2 comma is blank c2 and then I'll close the and function so if all three of those are true what I want it to do is mark it with an X Otherwise, I want it to mark with just a dash. And I'll close my if statement and press enter. So this row is not blank, it has a dash. If I fill this formula down, I'll see mostly dashes and a couple x's. So the next step would be to click at the top of the table, go to sort and filter, and click filter. Then I can filter for just my x values and click OK, and then select those rows and delete them. Now when I show all values again, the empty rows are gone. So I just showed you how to use an if statement to delete blank rows in Excel. First, we created an if statement to do a logical test, and then used a filter to show only the blank rows. My name is Bree Clark. Thanks for watching.